hundreds of school kids will now have a chance to go back to school in style. Yes, today was the annual Stuff the Bus event, an event WOWT 6 News proudly sponsors. Our Chase Moffitt is taking us all there. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. As the first car load started arriving this morning at the First National Bank parking lot inside Papillion's Shadow Lake Town Center, help was right there to bring in the supplies. The WOWT 6 News team alongside First National Bank's Circle One volunteers collected donations, school supplies to help children in need. When they start school, they will have the opportunity to go into school with a backpack full of supplies, notebooks, pens, pencils. Backpacks, crayons, markers, notebooks, coming in by the box loads, people bringing in supplies, helping kids go back to school. Now, there was an incentive. First 200 people got a First National Bank bag with a $5 gift card inside, but organizers say all the supplies go to a great cause, and they're not surprised by the generosity of the community. As the morning continued on, the generosity never stopped. This car packing in several boxes to help with the cause. And we found a father and daughter duo ready to do their part. I think it's important to learn and just get an ed education. And have the supplies to get it done? Mm-hmm. Hi, how are you? And then the guest appearance by Omaha's own former Creighton standout and now with the Chicago Bulls, Doug McDermott. He wasted no time putting to use his talented hands during the offseason from basketball. This for us? <laughs> nice. Omaha does a great job with stuff like this. You know, people are... You know, so caring and uh, just so friendly, and uh, that's all I hear when I'm in Chicago is how friendly people are back in Omaha and Iowa and around here. So, uh, you know, it's great to come back and help. Proven through each bag, each supply donated, that this community is ready to give back and help those who need it most. In Papillion, with photographer Dustin Dales, I'm Chase Moffitt, WWT 6 News. <laughs> I want to give a heartfelt thank you to all of those who donated and those of you that came out to say hi. I had a chance to be there myself and, well, we all had a good time at WWT 6 News. Hope you all did too. Now, if you didn't know, all this is going to go to four different groups. Partnership for Kids, Kids Can, Completely Kids, and the last group that these gifts will be going to is Hope Center for Kids.